Grower. Pink Grower. Jill was one who thought about it, actually. We do a lot of, uh, we've done the pink one in, in London where our head office is, just again for cancer uh, cancer research um, um, fundraising or, or charity raising. And uh, Jill had the idea of doing it um, doing it here, watching an American football match. They, you know, they've, uh, they've got all the pink trim on their outfits now. Oh, so. Yeah. yeah, so we decided to do that. And we contact, we're based in Rhode Island, so we contact the local uh, cancer awareness fund there, the, uh, the Gamma Foundation. And yeah, we're giving lots of t-shirts printed up and we'll do it bigger next year, I hope. And hopefully uh, brand it a little bit more strongly. It's been very, very popular. Thank you, Crowley. Um, well, it was the October Breast Cancer Awareness Month, so I wanted to start with Australia. Um, so we were fundraising for the Parliament. We joined up with Gloria Gemma Foundation in Rhode Island, so we thought that um, we get people on the machine, get to try the machine by row 500 meters, which is about two minutes of rowing, so they get to really fill the machine out, and then we uh, they donate a dollar per 100 meters row, so it's a five dollar donation, and uh, all the money goes towards the Gloria Gemma Foundation, and um, we give them a free t-shirt. Also, the pink always raises awareness and it also, people go, oh, pink.